What's going on, Summoners? LMC here. Uh, super awesome account and gift card giveaway video for you here today. Um, this was all courtesy of Bastion, who's donated two $25 gift cards for this giveaway. Uh, one of them is an iTunes gift card. One of them is a Google Play $25 gift card. And also special thanks to Hyder Kuhn, who has donated the account on the left here. For, for one lucky Summoner's War player. Um, somebody who might not have been very fortunate to get some monsters. You know, these accounts are out there for somebody who has a low-level account, might just be starting out in this game, or didn't get very good monster pulls. Both of these accounts have some pretty rare monsters. We're going to get into that in a second. So if you have a high-level account, don't just uh, try to register to win this. Um, details on how to get registered will be at the end of this video, so I encourage you to watch the entire thing and see what these are all about. And uh, only register for the things you're going to personally use. That's what the community is about, is um, helping out each other and helping out other players. So if you have no personal use for these items, don't register for them. Just a forewarning there. Um, so Hyder Kuhn donated the account on the left, and Freak donated the account on the right. Uh, word of warning, the account on the left, this level 40 account by Hyder Kuhn, is on the Asia server. The account on the right by Freak is on the global server. So if you are already playing, or have already started playing on the Asia server, this account right here on the left might be a good, really good account for you. You can get really excited about that. Um, but if you're already on the global server and you, there's no easy way to go between accounts. So if you're thinking about possibly using this as a sub account and you want to play with two different accounts, uh, no such luck. Don't even bother registering for this because you have to have your device specified for global or Asia server when you're doing your logins and stuff. So there's no easy way to switch between these things. So if you're a global player, um, and you just start playing this game, you know, sign up to win Freak's account if that's something that you think you can personally use. If you're already playing on the Asia server and you say, holy cow, um, Hyder Kuhn's account is so much better than mine, sign up to win this one. I just don't want anybody to sign up and win something that they're not going to personally use. I want these accounts to go to good use. Um, they were gracious enough to donate these accounts they're not using them so I just want to make sure they go to good use let's take a look at the accounts and again at the end of the video I will show you the form to submit to get registered to win this raffle all right well let's take a look at the Asia server Hyder Kuhn's account first this is an awesome account first of all this is probably the most experienced account we've ever given away Santa Elia here you see that right off the bat um, He's got a really nice island layout. He's got everything purchased pretty much. Let's take a look at the magic shop. We'll discover these together. So it looks like he has purchased all but the last slot for the magic shop. We have 75 max energy. That's pretty huge. Um, he's got lots of arena invites already saved up. 39. So as soon as you get this account, you can do 39 arena fights. That's crazy. 225 mana stones, 37 crystals, very cool. Um, let's keep taking a look here. <laughs> so he's got the expansions bought for the island, all except the last one down here. Not a big deal, I don't think there's really any reason to buy the last expansion. He's got the account looking really good, he's definitely put some time and work into this thing. So let's see here. Battles. He's already unlocked and done all of the hell modes for everything up till Timor Desert, Faimon Volcano. Some of this stuff still needs to be completed, so there's extra crystals right there if you complete hell mode in these areas. So it's kind of a good thing that hasn't been completed. Let's take a look at the fusion. Okay, so we got some high essences here. We got lots of lows here. Got six high fires, that's pretty good. Nine high lights, lots of light, or wind essences, I'm sorry. Lots of wind essences. There's a few light. So yeah, pretty well stocked 
11 high darks pretty cool all right so now what everybody's kind of waiting waiting for what are the monsters on this thing I don't even know myself wow two six stars three six stars three good six stars Kaz the the water samurai all right so let's take a look he has no skill ups he's already got swift blade runes plus 15 speed plus 12 plus 15 attack boy I, I bet this guy's amazing plus 15 five star attack and this is a plus 15 six star attack rune wow holy wow that's pretty pretty amazing this guy's gonna be really awesome let's take a look at his skills here I've never really looked at a Kaz too much slashes the enemy two times with the sword to decrease the attack gauge by 50 percent that's pretty huge with a 50 percent chance for each attack the attack power increases as the attack speed increases and he's already got a plus 15 speed rune I bet he does a ton of damage and he decreases the enemy's attack bar sharp energy of the sword crit rate is increased by 50 percent even more damage wields a sword to attack and decrease defense for two turns this is a amazing monster I mean some people are drooling right now but again this is on the Asia server so don't get too excited here's a natural five-star monkey king already has skill ups so the wind monkey king this is another monster I haven't really looked at too much what's the leader skill on him hit points of allied monsters by 33 percent really good leader skill okay so he's got a passive decreases the inflicted damage by 25 percent counterattacks with a 25 percent chance so kind of like like a violent rune as a passive here okay counterattacks with a 25 percent chance decreases the inflicted damage by 25 percent the inflicted okay so he takes 25 percent less damage and counterattacks with a 25 percent chance fantastic attacks and decreases the defense for two turns with a 75 percent chance and recovers your attack gauge by 50 percent so this guy's just an attacking fiend he's getting this passive at an extra 25 percent chance to attack again and he's increasing the attack gauge by 50 percent pretty pretty cool attacks with a monkey wand and stuns the enemy well I, I like this guy definitely good natural five star looks like that's what he's saving the wind essences for is to awaken this guy so doing pretty good there what do we got here we got vampire runes on him so every time he attacks he's stealing life this guy can be a beast in arena that's what it looks like to me it looks like he's gonna be a good character attack percent hit point percent hit point percent so yeah a very tanky hard to kill monster who especially with those vampire runes he's gonna revive a ton of his own life and these are guard runes down here so extra defense so very tanky very hard to kill really cool okay so six star cases of course this is an amazing monster this is one of the best four star monsters uh, she's already got some runes here attack percent I don't know if that's what we should be going for a different kind of a rune set here but you got some nice runes you got fatal so she's actually an attack a cases I'm sure she's gonna do just fine let's take a look at her normal stats here uh, speed crit rate damage not real high on resistance or accuracy which is kind of what you want to go for normally on an acasis if it's a dungeon acasis but in this case this one was ruined differently but still an amazing it's already a six star monster that's fantastic okay so five star fairy got some runes already going on for her we're gonna go through these a little bit quicker here uh, five star Lulu got some runes as well swift energy five star max level fire golem that's an interesting choice with runes already already got guard energy runes so he's definitely gonna serve as a tank on a team five star uh, fire inferno tagaros so fatal blade that's definitely good um, not the absolute best runes but he's he's usable five star awaken fire minotaurus blade all the way around look at that attack percent hit point percent crit rate percent boy Hyder Kuhn really knew what he was doing when he 
you know, start playing this game. I mean, these are good runes. These are percentage runes. These are plus nines all over the place, plus 12 on the high fire elemental, max level five star, max level five star, dark, harpy, helia, fatal energy runes. I mean, it goes on and on. This is an amazing account that is definitely the highest level account we've ever given away. Four star max level water pier. Already, these monsters all have runes. So there you go. I mean, what more can you ask for? You can play with all the, all these different monsters, try them out, put them on different teams. You got max level Fire Viking, Saik, he's got runes. Raouk's already got Fatal Blade runes. Um, got some other things here. Fire Werewolf, maybe some less known characters. Bernard, already a max level 4 star. He's got energy runes sitting on him. Ramagos, definitely a good character. So... Max level Wind Harpy has runes. I mean, he's put a lot of time into this. This is... Thank you, Hyder Kuhn, for uh, doing this and making somebody lucky enough to get it. Here's a Light Drunken Master. Look at all the fodder he's got here. Working on the next six star. Very, very, very cool. Got some Angelmon and everything. What more can you ask for? Let's, let's go back to the starting monsters here. So... Natural 5-star, amazing. Natural 4-star, ruined up, extremely amazing, in my opinion. I think this guy is just a beast. I think for some dungeon battles, he's really going to pack a hurt. So, that is amazing. So, I think that's enough about this account. Remember, it's on the Asia server, and, uh, yeah. So if you're on the Asia server, Free to Play Gaming Channel 5001 is on the global server, as well as our guild in the sub guilds for Free to Play Gaming. So take that into consideration. If you're really vested into the global server, this isn't going to do you any good for this Asia server account. So just be aware of that. Okay, so let's take a look at Freak's account here. This is his sub account that he was using to farm dungeons, light dungeons, for his main account, actually. He was friends with this account. So that actually worked out pretty well for him. He ended up getting the light almond from it. We got Santa Elia. Um, these are just going to become more and more rare because these were a one-time offer reward. It's not a great thing that she does for the account. She gives you plus one energy, but still, it's pretty cool to get an account that has these, especially if you're just a starting player who doesn't have a chance to get that Santa Elia anymore. All right, so level 21, we got extra energy, we got extra arena points, we got 50,000 mana stones, got some crystals. Oh yeah, I wanted to take a look at the gift box here. Bunch of extra energy sitting here for Hyder Coon's account as well. So if we take a look at the gift box on Freak's account, a uh, little bit of energy. Um, let's take a look at the magic shop. Looks like he unlocked every slot in the magic shop. So that's extra crystals you don't have to spend to do that. That's definitely um, recommended for new players to unlock all the magic shop slots because sometimes really good runes and uh, mystic scrolls up here in the magic shop and are worth buying. So you guys might have noticed down here, I think this is the star of the show for this global server account here. Lucian, one of the most sought after monsters. And I can attest, he is just a powerhouse. He can just blow away arena teams if you ruin him properly. I got, I got mine with uh, four rage runes with attack percent all the way around the board. And he is just a beast. He's doing 50% crit on my character. Probably, probably my favorite character on my account right now. So, let's take a look at his fusion material. He mentioned that there are... Okay, so we got some... Some uh, some magic, a little bit of fire, a little bit of water. Got a couple highs there, a couple winds. Got a ton of light. So it's worth mentioning for this light, if you get light bear man, light inugami, or light vagabond, those are high level characters. They're easily farmable, which people use at endgame arena and endgame dungeons to help them do like dragons b10, giants b10. 
very amazing monsters because of their unique skills. So you already have the awakening materials right here to pretty much awaken all three of those monsters. So that is definitely a bonus. Uh, got some dark here too. What else do we got? This is pretty exciting. I'm exploring this for the first time myself. I didn't even check Hyder Kuhn to see if he had storage. Okay, so he's got a Devilmon in storage on uh, Freak's account on the global server here. And it looks like uh, only five slots unlocked, which I think is the default. Let's see if we can't find that for Hyder Kuhn here. Just want to make sure we're not missing anything. Any valuable information, anything more to drool over. I don't even see... I'm not seeing the storage area. Maybe he didn't purchase that yet. So, not a big deal. Okay. Actually, let's take a look. I forgot to look at his glory shop. Let's see what he's got purchased here. Okay, so I would buy that Devilmon if we had enough glory points, but we don't right now. So he's already got Sanctum of Energy leveled up. That gives him more maximum energy. Fairy Trees leveled to 2. Mysterious Plants at 7. That's one of the first things new players should work on. Do we have any of the attack things leveled up? No, it doesn't look like we have any attack things leveled up right now. But yeah, Mysterious Plant, all that other stuff's really good. So let's take a look at Freak's account real quick. Not sure what he has leveled up. Again, I would buy that Devilmon if I could because those are very important. Sanctum of Energy, level 2. Okay. So we don't have any level ups from the Glory Shop yet. But that's absolutely fine. That's something for you to work on if you win the account here. So let's let's make the wish real quick. Why not? Because this account's not going to be played until the winner is revealed. And these accounts are going to be on giveaway for at least a couple weeks. So probably middle of February. Uh, only 5,000 mana stones. Probably, uh, I don't know, what day is it? The 4th right now? Probably around February 15th to the 20th is when we're going to do a Twitch stream and do these giveaways for the gift cards and the accounts. So make sure you're following me on Twitch and you won't miss when the actual giveaway takes place. But let's take a look at the monsters on Freak's global server account. Lucian, here he is, 5-star. Fantastic. Um, some people would be so excited to get this monster. So... Water Garuda, another fantastic monster which removes buffs from your players. It's just a natural two-star, but I think everybody should really have one. Him or another monster that's capable of doing the same thing, like the Water Death Knight, he can also remove debuffs from your team and grant immunity. So if you don't have a Water Death Knight, definitely get yourself one of these. He already has one. He's got a Copper, Max Level, 4-star, Ramagos, 4-star, Awakened. Uh, Wind Rakasha, really great healer. Um, you can check out my Giants B10 video to see how good he is there. Bernard, so he's been working on a wind team. He's got Shannon going here. So he's already got some of the wind team monsters. Um, some other three stars here. Nothing I'm really seeing of high note. Another copper. I think uh, that's Fusion, the Marshall Cat. Not 100% sure on that. But yeah, Lucian account. Very neat. So I think that's about it. Let's get to the details on how you guys can get registered to win these as well as the two $25 gift cards, courtesy of Bastion. I believe we went over everything. All right. So to get registered to win these, it's going to be very similar as it was last time with the Google form you guys had to fill out. In the description of this video, I'll post a link to the Google form. So if you click on that, you're going to have to, this time you're going to have to log in through um, a Google account. So most of you already have one. I think it's a requirement to even post a comment on YouTube. You have to link your Google account. So the reason I'm doing that is twofold. One, because you can only submit a single time per Google account. 
And two, if you accidentally make a mistake when you're answering these questions, which happened actually quite a few times during the last video, you can log back in and change your answers. So it's kind of a win-win. All right, so if you're seeing, this is the correct form right here. If you see this uh, banner, you're in the right place. Free to play gaming February dual account giveaway. Uh, it should say gift card as well. Thanks to Bastian Freak and Hyder Kuhn. Huge shout out to you guys. Really appreciate you uh, enabling me to do these giveaways and give something back to the community. It's really awesome that you're doing that. So, how long have you been playing Summoner's War? Super easy, select how long you've been playing. Um, spoiler alert, this game's been out for about 8 months. So if you've been playing since launch, 6 to 8 months, just select that. Less than a month, 1 to 2, 2 to 4. Super easy. Which of the following interests you? So these are some things that I'm mulling around. Um, I don't have time for everything, but select the things that you're most interested in seeing more content of. Whether that be guide videos, Twitch streams with Mystic Scrolls, arena battle videos. I've, I'm really close to uh, you know making a big push in arena. I think I have 1,800 rank right now, and maybe those videos are going to be interesting to you. So if you'd like to see that, pick that. Monster review videos or monster spotlight videos that describe um, a particular monster, their strengths and weaknesses, as well as rune suggestions. If that interests you, select that checkbox. Free-to-play merchandise. Uh, spoiler alert. I might have some people doing some handcrafting of some pretty cool Summoner's War monsters. We'll see what happens with that, but uh, maybe that's, if that's something that you might be interested in, is uh, like Summoner's War plushies, uh, select that box. Forums or other features on freetoplaygaming.com. And also other. If you, guys, if you have a suggestion on what you'd be interested in me spending my time on and the rest of the community spending the editors spending their time on, what would you like to see more of? You can uh, select the other box and give me a personal comment. So I'd appreciate that. Just try to be honest. If there's something that you really just browse over and you don't spend time on and you don't enjoy, just don't select it. You know, you don't. There's no right answer to this question. No right answer to this question. It's just kind of a poll. And very last, well, second to last question: Which prizes are you guys interested in? Again, only check the items you'll personally use. So if you're playing on a Google device, Summoner's War, select the Google Play gift card. If you're playing on an on a iPad or iPhone, select the iTunes gift card. Um, if you're not going to use it, don't select it, because then we're giving the other players a better chance to, to get it, which is, you know, I want to make sure these items go to good use. So, also... Make sure you're taking into account that the level 40 Hyder Kuhn account is on the Asia server, and the Freak account with the Lucian is on the global server. So don't just... Asia server doesn't mesh well with global server if you're trying to play two accounts, so if you have a high level account already, don't try not to bother with the Asia server or global server, depending on where you're at. Um, that's why I cannot do Mystical Scroll Summons, on the Asia server because my phone is registered for the global server so if you are playing on the Asia server and you want me to open up scrolls for you on Twitch it can't happen um, same kind of deal here with these accounts so just be aware of that also same as last time if you posted at least one comment on the free to play gaming YouTube page most of you probably have but if you haven't um, just give a shout out to everybody who makes these giveaways possible Bastion Hyder Kuhn, and Freak. You know, just give a shout out underneath this video because I need to have at least one comment on the YouTube page for me to contact you if you win. The last time we had three winners and all three of them responded quickly and it was really easy to contact them and give them their prizes. So I appreciate that. Congratulations to the past winners. And just hit the submit button and you should see a message that says uh, thank you for you know entering the giveaway and good luck so good luck everyone i uh, hope you guys are enjoying the content here and we got uh i got a lot of guide videos in the works here just got to find time to do them so i did update the twitch counter for those of you interested who are watching this video as soon as it comes out um sunday february 8th february 8th at 11 
a.m. Eastern is going to be the next Twitch broadcast tentatively, but the countdown timer is always on freetoplaygaming.com for the next live Twitch broadcast. So if you got Mystic Scrolls to open, send me an email. Um, the email address I'll post in the description of this video. And as always, thank you guys so much for the support. Thank you, everybody who makes this possible. I want to give a shout-out to Childish Plays, who did a spotlight video on everything that's happening in the free-to-play community. And uh, he's doing some amazing things over there. He's doing some arena grinding. He gives player reviews. Uh, just general, really great videos. So a huge shout-out to him. Check out his channel if you haven't. And there's a ton of other people who are worth checking out, too. But take care, everyone. Thanks for the support, and good luck in winning. Free to play, signing out for now.